Guinean government officials are barred from travel until further notice and they must hand over their official vehicles to the military. A degree of normality returned to the streets of Guinea's capital, Conakry, on Monday, the day after a military unit ousted President Alpha Conde. Traffic resumed, albeit through military checkpoints, and some shops reopened around the main administrative district of Kaloum. The area on Sunday witnessed heavy gunfire as the special forces troops battled soldiers loyal to the president. But having seized control, the elite unit now faces the task of maintaining it. Colonel Mamadi Dumbuya, the leader of the unit that removed Conde, gathered government officials together on Monday. They've been barred from leaving the country until further notice. Dumbuya also instructed them to hand back their official vehicles, though he added that there would be no witch hunt. The frontier aerial. Air borders have been reopened, the soldiers have said, and a curfew in mining areas lifted. Guinea has the world's largest reserves of bauxite, an ore used in the production of aluminum. Aluminum prices soared on Monday to a 10-year high over fears of supply disruption. The apparent coup has also been met with condemnation from some of Guinea's strongest allies. The United Nations quickly denounced the takeover and both the African Union and West Africa's regional bloc, ECOWAS, have threatened sanctions. But on the streets of Conakry, some, like Abdullahi Bangura, described Dumbuya's arrival as a blessing. Because our mothers were in the streets, I don't know how to describe it, like abandoned animals, our children killed, you have no idea. Politics destroyed everything. In a word, I'm relieved. Dumbuya told state television that poverty and endemic corruption had driven his forces to oust Conde. But uncertainty remains. While the military unit appears to have Conde in detention, other branches of the army are yet to publicly comment. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.